Hi, I'm Brinton Parson, and I'm here today to tell you a little bit about the Alexander Robertson School. Thank you for joining me. By design, ARS is purely an elementary school, the only independent elementary school in the city. Our students range from 4 to 11 years old, junior kindergarten to grade 5. And as the defining slogan for Gerber Baby Foods declared, babies are our business, our only business. At ARS, elementary school education is our business, our only business. Think back to your own elementary school years and compare your experience with what happens here at Alexander Robertson as the only pure elementary school in the city. There is an enormous advantage to the specificity of educating children within a single developmental phase. Nursery school is vastly different from elementary school, and there are no toddlers here at ARS. Middle and high school students are also vastly developmentally different from elementary aged children, and we do not have any adolescent students overshadowing our oldest student group of fifth graders. Our fifth grade students gain enormous confidence from being the oldest students. Most children their age at other schools are feeling dwarfed and self-conscious as they intermingle with older, fully adolescent students. Our fifth graders are the academic and social giants here. They are revered, respected, socially secure, academically sound, and ethically grounded. Good students and good people. The elementary school age child is in its truly formative years and all child psychologists such as Froebel, Dewey, and Giselle, as well as educators such as Montessori and Piaget, recognize the importance of the fundamental foundations that are laid exclusively and permanently during this time. Another unique distinction is that we have one class per grade and our classes are intentionally small, affording every student the benefit of adult attention at all times. Our goal is to have every child appropriately challenged all day, every day. We provide both intentional and spontaneous opportunities for our students to learn from as well as socialize and play with students in other grades so that the children here are truly vital members of the whole school and are not socially limited to their immediate classmates. ARS is a very small school with a large cultural and linguistic footprint. Many families come to us through Columbia University and NYU because we welcome international students whose parents are visiting professors. More than one third of our student body is multilingual and speak a language other than English at home. We capitalize on multiple languages and formally teach English, French, Spanish, Mandarin, mathematics, music, and coding, all of which we teach as languages. Our curricular standards meet and then exceed those set by the state of New York, and our entire curriculum for each grade is available on the website. We don't stop there. We include the curriculum for all of our enrichment classes as well. Overscheduled New York City children often have very little time to read for pleasure, so we have silent reading every day, which is enormously important and statistically proven to strengthen reading skills across the board. Our science classes meet three times a week, and foster children's natural curiosity for the world around them. Science is a wonderful springboard through which all other subjects can be taught and integrated. Physical education classes also meet three times each week, providing the classical vision of a sound mind in a sound body. Families choose bi-weekly foreign language classes in either French or Spanish. Both music and art are also taught twice each week within the regular school day and Poetry at Dawn, a beloved feature of our school, is open to all interested students twice a week before morning classes even begin. There is one period each week devoted to Mandarin, to ethics, to library, and to wellness, which includes social emotional learning, meditation, breathing, and yoga. There's a club activity of the student's choice from a wide selection offered each trimester, everything from robotics to rumba. A weekly highlight is our whole school assembly held every Friday to which parents are invited and at which the students learn to be good performers, polished public speakers, excellent listeners, and attentive audience members. Our coding classes are offered for all students beginning in the first grade because basic mathematical skills are required in order for coding to be meaningful. 
Our school-wide Coding for Good program is based on the 17 premises that the United Nations established to sustain and improve our planet, which ties into our unique ethics program, reflecting not only the value base, but also the integrated approach that we strive for in all subject areas. If the goal of an education is to prepare children for the world in which they live, our specific goal is to prepare our students for their next academic experience. ARS graduates are consistently accepted to the middle school programs of their family's choice, be it another independent, parochial, selective, or local public school. Our faculty is actively involved in the application process to ongoing schools, and our students not only attain impressive acceptance rates, but also are successful students in a wide variety of different middle school programs once they matriculate, which reflects the enormous amount of intellectual and notional adaptability that they acquire as students at ARS. It is actually far easier to select a good middle school program for your child from our fifth grade than it is from an early childhood program before your child's foundational elementary years have been laid and built. But you can easily determine the best elementary school setting for your child next year. Children learn most easily and retain more of what they learn when they are relaxed, happy, and enjoying themselves. A good example of our emphasis on this concept is our new math curriculum called Bridges, used in all grades, which reinforces newly introduced math concepts through playing mathematical games instead of racing through worksheet drills. Our approach and this curriculum foster true mathematical thinking and allow students to engage with math by playing with numbers. From there, it is easy to have them see writing as playing with words, coding as playing with computers, and science as playing with the environment. We have a very cutting edge curriculum, but ARS is the oldest co-educational elementary school in the city, founded in 1789. That was the year that George Washington was elected as the first president of the United States. And although ARS has evolved in many ways in the 233 years since its founding, its mission, based on the fundamental principles of the Scottish Enlightenment, which was to educate all children, regardless of gender, social class, or race, has remained firmly in place, unchanged. It was very radical to educate multiracial and female children in the 1700s. Upholding the original mission to educate across socioeconomic groups, we maintain the lowest tuition rate of any independent school in the city with generous financial aid offered to those in need. We value our traditions without being mired in tradition. We are educating today's children for tomorrow's world without knowing precisely what tomorrow's world will look like. Internationally renowned historian and philosopher Yuval Harari believes that future citizens will need to face not only the unknown, but also the uncertain. At ARS, our students are well-trained in analytic and critical thinking, as well as written and oral communication. They are given a strong academic and intellectual foundation. There is no better preparation for the unknown and the uncertain, and this preparation must be laid in the elementary years. Everyone always asks about our parents' association. We have a strong one. Our PA is active and vibrant. While participation is not obligatory, it is a warm and welcoming group to which membership is automatic through enrollment, and many families spend as much time and effort as their schedules permit. Our faculty and staff members welcome communication with families, and we are informative and responsive. Our classroom teachers send home weekly reports, there are three formal report cards each year. There are three faculty meetings each month and mandatory professional and teacher training days throughout the year so that the faculty remain aware of best practices and new educational research. For additional information and news about ARS, I refer you to the Robertson RAG, our school newspaper published each trimester by the fifth grade students. Past issues are available on the website and I invite and encourage you to visit not only the website, but also the school itself at your earliest convenience. I look forward to welcoming you in person, and I'll meet you at the door.